Hi, my name is David Hoff and I'm here today at 2250 Sharon Road in Myers Park, Landon and Caitlin Castle's home, and I'm honored to be representing them in the sale of this home. Everyone knows Landon Castle is an amazing NASCAR driver, but what many people may not know is that Landon and his wife are also excellent interior designers and decorators and renovators. You guys will not be disappointed when you see the inside of this home. Yeah, I'm Landon Castle and this is my home in Myers Park. We we bought this house as a three bedroom and one bathroom house that was only 1,500 square feet and pretty much gutted it and added a second story. We wanted a island for the kitchen that could kind of float around and eat breakfast, like a breakfast table or a lunch table. Um, so we just had this made instead of looking for something. Uh, we bought this old table and chairs um, off of Park Road and this is, this is a, an old English table that's over 100 years old. So this is my office. Um, don't really have a traditional desk or anything. This here was uh, is a coffee table that my great grandfather made. Uh, he made this probably 10 years ago, um, and uh, he passed away in the last couple years. But this was one of the last things that he made. Uh, for me, as you can see, he used the dark and light wood to make an L um, on the corners for my name, which is kind of cool. Uh, this is from a race in Daytona. Uh, I was the number one car uh, where I pushed Tony Stewart across the finish line to win the race, and I finished third. Um, I was able to get all four drivers in the picture to sign it, including Dale Jr., um, although him and Clint Boyer were a little reluctant to sign it since they lost the race because of me pushing Tony. <laughs> this used to be the only bathroom in the house. Um, it, the sink and toilet were right here, and then there was a um, tub and shower, uh, and that was it. That was the only bathroom in the house, but since we were adding a bathroom upstairs and we were adding a master suite downstairs, we just took up the space and used it as a half bath and used the space on the other side of the wall as um, a closet. The master bedroom is, is really pretty. My wife wanted a white bedroom, and, um, and so she got one. We had a lot of uh, custom drapes made. The master bath here is really nice. We kind of opted to go without a tub and, um, and built a really nice big shower with two heads um, and a removable. Um, we've got marble countertops and marble floors and the floors are heated as well, which is a really nice addition. We do have some uh, local artwork. This is from uh, Ken Young Youngstrom, a good friend of mine and a great artist here in the Charlotte area. I'm really proud to have some of his work in the house. Uh, he also made some artwork for my son Beckham, which is in his bedroom. Okay. So kind of a, just just a regular family family living space upstairs. Here we've got um, a living room and two bedrooms. This is this is my son Beckham's room. Um, another uh, beautiful piece by Ken. My wife really wanted a nice. Uh, laundry room. Wanted to be able to close the door and do her laundry and have a sink, uh, wash the dog and have space to um, wrap presents and do things like that and, and just tuck stuff away. So it's, it's really, it's been really cool to have a big laundry room. I feel like that was something that we invested in and we were uh, really happy that we did. We definitely got our money's worth there. One of the kind of perks of having an old house is is still having the coal chute in the side of the house so instead of getting rid of it we just I cleaned it up and painted it and uh, we don't throw any coal down there though it's but it, it's kind of a cool nod to the history of a home like this. I think our, our probably evening routine is to run over to Selwyn and uh, go to TCBY and get some ice cream <laughs> and uh, and back home he, he, he loves it he'll just sit here with ice cream in his, uh, in his lap and eat it so uh, we're super close to Selwyn um, and the shops over there and restaurants and, uh, and it's a pretty quick um, jaunt over to Park Road Shopping Center as well. So uh, we, this is kind of a really central location in Myers Park that's, that's five minutes from South Park and five minutes from Park Road Shopping Center in Selwyn and really easy to get uptown. We built a grill for pretty much everybody else. Uh, my wife and I are both vegetarian so uh, we don't do too much grilling. I guess we could grill some vegetables and stuff, but, uh, but the grilling is definitely for our guests. 
I'm David Hoffman, and I appreciate you guys coming along for this tour of Landon and Kaylin Castle's home. When you see what you can get in Landon and Kaylin's house for under $800,000 in one of the most popular parts of Charlotte, you too will want to move here like I did 12 years ago.